I will attempt to read it. If someone oh, could hold no, it across the room. To recognize and celebrate Rupert Twink Star and his contributions to the city of Columbus, whereas the youngest of three boys, Rupert Twink Star, was born and raised in Mount Sterling, Ohio, where he left to study business administration at Ohio University Woo! and joined the Reserved Officers Training Corps in 1940. And whereas, six months before his college graduation, Twink, Twink volunteered into active duty with the Army and was assigned to the 101st Infantry Division in 1945 in time to fight in the Battle of the Bulge. And another whereas. Whereas, <laughs> he would later be awarded a Bronze Star and a Combat Infantry Badge for his bravery after <laughs> volunteering. Yes, sir. After volunteering to sneak past Germany, German enemy lines and his refusal to surrender that led to his capture and serving as a prisoner of war as he spent four months in Nazi prison camps. And whereas, after helping to secure <laughs> victory in Europe, Twink went on to graduate from Ohio University before starting a successful career in real estate, serving as the president of the Columbus Board of Realtors, and in senior advisory positions on many business and civic organizations in the city of Columbus. Two more whereases. Whereas, <laughs> Twink met his partner and love of his life, Alan Wingfield, in 1954, and would go on to become a mighty LGBT activist. 53 years together. <laughs> Helping to repeal the military's don't ask, don't tell policy. And whereas, Honored as the Grand Marshal of the Stonewall Columbus Parade in 2009 for his activism and dedication to his country, Twink remains an inspiring force in the Columbus community and serves as a role model for many. Now therefore, be it resolved by the Council of the City of Columbus that this council does hereby recognize and celebrate Rupert Twink Star and his contributions to the City of Columbus on this Sunday, July 16, 2017. <laughs> I'm overwhelmed. I'm, I, these are my friends. This is my life. These are the people. I go to church in the morning, first congregational, and I've been every lit every. I, I'm a, a big giver there, and I go to go to the best parlor in town in Chicago. I've given over a hundred thousand there. I've made the legacy there, and I'm no longer the legacy of YMCA or my. Church, I now just keep it for myself. <laughs> <laughs> What's left? No. Uh, no. Uh, again, uh, Stonewall, uh, uh, HRC, what more could one have in a way of good friends? Uh, this, you are my life, you are my friends, and who needs money when you've got friends like you all? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, uh, but, but great thanks to the candy. <laughs> <laughs>